what he played. Oh, what did he, he play? He played bishop f6. What? Oh, what he said. And according to the engines, this is the best move. Oh, of course, it's Vishiana. Oh, I think the hardest moves to Fight see are those, <laughs> yeah, those really quiet moves where it doesn't really threaten anything yet <laughs> immediately. But it does threaten Rook to that square that you were pointing at, Rook e7. Yes. Look, this is about to get very bad for Black. Okay. Oh, I'm just going to be honest that's here. That's a huge threat, actually. This is a very ugly... And the bishop's also hanging. And the bishop is hanging here, of course. Wow, this is pretty crazy here. Master Sviller, what do you have to say about this position here right now? Is it just over for MBL? Maybe not over yet, but he clearly, I think, that whole sequence, starting with the previous move and culminating with this really beautiful tactical shot that uh, Anand just showed, uh, has taken him by surprise. Also, perhaps it's time to take a look at the clocks because MVL is down to a minute and a half against the minutes for Vichy. Uh, this is rapidly uh, uh, approaching some kind of a conclusion. Uh, and yeah, MVL will need to calculate uh, very quickly and very cleanly from here to, to stay in the game. Uh, he is in trouble, but perhaps uh, well, he takes there the could still be some twists and turns. He doesn't care about anything, he says. Wow. Oh, he gets Look, he in with his rook instantly. Hold and on, there's a check fella. coming up. Queen is hanging. We check yeah. and I'm just going to move the Is he going to just completely crush this game. Is she in well, the, the big question here? for me is if you just ignore, or not ignore, but say I cannot do anything at all about the threat of that rook check, and I move the queen to, yeah, to two squares diagonally, or that, yeah, I was choosing between this square and the f5 square. Uh, how do you win from here? Because you still need to land some kind of a decisive blow. Okay, if you give a check, yeah, and the king moves to the side, now you are saying that there is no good discovered check by the rook. There's I no can't play. see anything that wins on the spot, but perhaps, yes, yeah, something like, like the move that uh, 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 James is highlighting there just oh wins goodness. a lot of material. Because I don't see mate. I don't see how to, how to actually deliver a, check. deliver a checkmate. A check. Here it is. The check's on the board, yeah. guys. <laughs> check is on the board. Wow. Boom! And he has to maybe move the bishop <laughs> somewhere. Sorry. Maybe you could even do this. Like, what the heck is this? But bishop e7 is a move. Bishop e7 and... definitely is a move. You could also yeah. consider, yeah, starting with this and then playing bishop e7. Repeat first, repeat yeah. one time. Yeah. That, is, is repeat. that is the old professional in Anand showing off there because he, he wants to gain some more time. He doesn't really care about uh, MVL also not having a lot of time. He wants time on his clock. And yeah, it feels like bishop e7 here might be very, very strong, attacking both the queen and the rook on f8. Uh, Black has only one check, that check that has been on the board for a while now, taking uh, a pawn. Yeah, there it goes. Oh, he plays there, it. There it goes. Ooh, look at him. He just put his hand on oh, his head. Saying, He's like, oh, I thought I it do? was going to be a draw here. Wow. <laughs> no really no such thing, yeah. There's some way to get out of this, in fact. I mean, it's, it's not to get out of it. It's like the engine's like, it's not that bad. Believe it or not, the engine says plus two, which is baffling here. Like, how is it only one? It's not even but 1.9 here. In fact, they give, like, takes... And then Takes. what happens? Yeah. And this might be, uh, we should stick with this <laughs> one because one it F7 does F5. look like it might conclude any moment. But I will give a slight general overview because the match, the match itself is looking very, very unclear. Uh, uh, Harika on board 5 is massively better, arguably winning against Belahat and Ashvili now. Channel. Having very, very good winning chances here. I would suggest <laughs> he probably is just flat out winning. Well, Vishy with his youthful energy at the age of 53, <laughs> creating all those decisive games. How does he do it? It's amazing. Wow. wow. Yeah. I was always told that you are 21 with a couple of years experience. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what he's showing here. A lot of years experience and five-time world champion as well. Not playing any games today. I can imagine how annoying this pawn on H2 must be now. That mm -hmm. is so far advanced. You can't capture it, but your king is sort of trapped for now right but i think he'll just ignore it and get his rook into the game use the queen and i believe vishy should be able to convert this what is very interesting is that even though vishy is completely winning here his team is going to most likely lose this match it's very possible and it's very possible we have seen many things happen here but vishy holding it from the front here leading from the front trying to win this game Oh, and we have a big result. In fact, a big turnaround, I would say. But... Just a bit. As expected. But looks like it's not going to be enough. Oh, Vichy wins. Mm. Wow. Even though Ganges Grandmasters might not win this match, Vichy beating MVL is a big, big result, right? And uh, Master Swiddler, you called it even before the game started.